it finished one all. I don't know how you feel about that, given how late you took the lead in the game. Mixed. Feel feel disappointed we've not won. Um, won because of the performance. Um, and, and certainly in the second half where we looked more of a threat up the the top end of the pitch. Because I thought we got in some really good areas in the first half. We just didn't um, make as much of a difference in that area of the pitch as what we should have. Um, and that was a challenge at half-time. Do a bit more. Keep trying to get there. And we did. And, you know... Great breakthrough, good move. Lots of players high up the pitch, you know, and, and when you do that, you, you can give yourself an opportunity to score goals. Brilliant finish from Brennan, looked like he had a load to do. With it, I haven't seen it back, but it looked a really good finish. And uh, and then you want to see the game out, but so t I understand, you know, you're away from home and, um, you know, good atmosphere and all that sort of stuff, but, um, but to concede the goal we did is, is disappointing. So, mixed feeling, if I'm being honest. Um, proud of the team because of the way we played and, and the growth that we, that we made today. But then at the same time, um, disappointed that we've not won. Because, and the lads are disappointed, it's a quiet dressing room because they know it's a game we should have won. Um, but, um, but I'm not going to be too narrow-minded enough to not see all the good things we did in the game because we did. Yeah, I mean, you had to really, first of all, withstand that early barrage, didn't you, from 15 minutes. And when it's like that, it's important to come through that because then yeah. you can grow into the game. Yeah, but it, it may be, but I can't, I can't think, you know, that I don't think our goal was peppered too much. Maybe, maybe I'll have to look at it back and maybe it was, but I never thought like we were on the brink of conceding. You're right, we need to get a bit of control in the game, but we did. And, and we got in some really good positions first half, some really good positions first half. And if somebody said we were going to get into them that many, then you probably would have taken it. You then want to make sure you try and you know do something some, something with it, which I know is the hardest part of the game. But but we have players that can make a difference. And um, second half, I thought we did, did did well with our possession. We were the team that really wanted to build up and play and control the game. And and in the end, we um, we got the breakthrough. But just disappointed that we've not seen an outcome. Yeah, because you could sense that it, it might be coming, couldn't you? Because you know you threw Morgan Gibbs White on, who we'll talk about in a moment if we may. But you threw him on, and and then you you know created quite a bit up front, and you can kind kind of sense it round here that they were a bit worried, and then sure enough, you did get it. Well, we made changes to win the game for sure. We were never going to settle for the nil nil. That's not our way. That's not not our identity. Sometimes you have to take it, and you know and we'll have to take the draw today. But the idea was to win, um, and. Um, we did enough to win, but at the same time, we've, we've let Everton off the hook with the way we've con conceded the goal. It's a heck of a league, isn't it? I mean, we're seeing some games that are just, I mean, they're, they're off the scale compared to what Forest fans have been used to seeing. Yeah, and it's, and it's amazing to be, to be part of it. Um, I mean, the other thing, you know, let's not lose sight of the fact, you know, we, this was a much improved away performance from Newcastle, you know, um, and we're disappointed with the point, you know, so maybe that's showing the growth in the team. Um, so listen, you, I've said to you a million times, Con. I believe in the process of learning, of preparation, and analysing the game properly back to the objectives. And I, I know when I analyse the game back tonight and tomorrow, I'll be really pleased with, with a lot of things. But I always want me more. Uh, what's up with Dean Henderson? That seemed a strange one. He, after he got injured in the second half, and he just kept sort of stamping his no, right no, no, foot. Is he all right? No, he okay? yeah, yeah, he seems all right. Yeah, he yeah. seems all right. I think he's okay. Yeah. Okay. Uh, let's talk about Morgan Gibbs White then, if we may, because just at the time we were talking about all your new signings, mm. you were just about making another yeah. new signing. Yeah. I mean, it's he's terrific to have on yeah. board, isn't he? I know, I know you like him a lot. I'm lucky with that. <laughs> yes, yeah, Thursday. Uh, that's why I turned my phone off. Um, <laughs> Yeah, Lord, listen, delighted to, to, to have Morgan as a player that we've pursued for a little while now. And, um, you know, to finally get him over the line is is really, really pleasing for us. You know, it's, it's not quite the numbers that have been reported, um, but it doesn't matter anyway. You know, we, we, we wanted him here and, um, you know, we feel he can be a really big player for us. And um, you've seen even today some of the things that he did, you know, is, is the type of type type of player and the type of team that we want to be, you know, even at this highest level. So, um, so we're, you know, we're really happy to give him a new home. We want to look after him, we want to push him, we want to challenge him and hopefully he can make a really big difference for us, you know. But, but at the same time, we will always be about the collective here, you know, and there's a lot of new players coming in and we're, we're for all of the talk of that, oh, sorry mate, we're really enjoying the challenge of putting a new team, a newish team together and building on last year and, and um, you know, we want to thrive in it. And it's coming together, isn't it? Well, we've definitely made some forward steps in the last couple of games. Um, that's for sure. And uh, um, we've got to keep growing. We've got, we've got to put layers every day on our work. Every, you know, keep improving. There's going to be ups and downs. We're going to win games. We're going to lose games. You know, good runs, maybe not so good runs. But we've got to stick together. We've got to stick to the plan. Believe in how we work. Believe in what we do. 
and then yeah, we'll see see where it takes us. But um, like you said before, we've had three three games now. It's been brilliant to be part of it, and uh, we look forward to the League Cup now on Tuesday.